This is verse 3 of the first chapter of the Gospel of Matthew. Matthew working his way through the Old Testament genealogy that leads from Abraham to Christ. And we pick up with uh, Udas here in verse 3, who is Judah. Of course, one of the uh, patriarchs of the twelve tribes. Uh, and of course, Jesus himself descends from Judah, so we're particularly interested in this tribe. Post positive da. Uh, so Judah, again a son from Gana'o, to give birth to or to be the father of. This is the uh, third person uh, singular, aorist active indicative. So Judas begat, and then in the accusative, ton Fares. This is Perez in the Old Testament, who was the uh, son of Judah. Uh, Kai ton Zara, so the other, the other son of Judah was uh, uh, Zira, and uh, these were born. Ek uh, preposition takes the uh, genitive tase uh, Tamar. This is, of course, Tamar, the story in which uh, Judah had uh, relations with uh, his daughter-in-law, whose husband had died. You probably are familiar with that. Uh, some have thought the reason the women are introduced here, four in all, as the genealogy is disclosed, is because in each one of them there is a little bit of a, a taint, you might say, uh, either because they're Gentile or otherwise involved in what amounts to a sort of uh, morally questionable situation, as would be the case here. Uh, others just think it's only the women are just mentioned because they represent a slight uh, aberration in the ordinary course of events in the genealogy. So one way or another, we have the first uh, woman who's introduced here, Tamar, and then uh, Perez or Fares, uh, De, post positive again, his son became the father of Ton Hezrom or Hezron in the Old Testament, uh, which is the uh, genealogy as reported in the accusative. Uh, then Hesrom, now in the nominative, de, post positive, again I send, same word, ton Aram, uh, which is uh, ram, as you read it in the Old Testament text. And so uh, just continuing the genealogy here as we march through the uh, uh, sequence from father to son, and uh, that's about as much as can be said about this verse.